Greetings and welcome, welcome back to another wristwatch video and another review. However, it's not a wristwatch review per se, but a wristwatch strap or wristwatch straps review because there will be multiple of them. And obviously, as you can see by the title, the straps were made by the company Artem. Also, you probably noticed it said includes paid promotion at the beginning of this video. That is because this is in fact a sponsored video. Why? Basically, I reached out to Artem, asked them if they want to have a sort of collaboration, maybe send me some of their products for review and they accept. So that is why I think this is sponsored because I got these products for free. Also, one more thing they mentioned, which I found interesting, is that in fact, I could make both a positive and a negative review. However, if I make a negative review, I should just list what I dislike so they can improve their products even more, which was already a good sign to begin with because most companies don't really like negative reviews and prefer, would prefer if you just kept quiet about all the bad stuff about their products. But I guess Arden was a bit different in that way, which I think was pretty cool. So before we uh, go to the unboxing, check out how the product actually arrives at your address and talk about the specific products I got sent. Uh, let's take a quick look at their website, what they offer, what their motto, what their goal is. So according to their website, Arden was founded by two friends in the city of Adelaide, Australia. And the reason they uh, started the company is that they could not find good quality sailcloth straps and they decided to start making their own, which I think is pretty good motivation and I think is a pretty good solution if you have a problem uh, similar to theirs. And their goal is to make the best sailcloth straps on the market. Now, the motto of the company is a Latin phrase, Ars est celare artem, which means true art conceals the means by which it is achieved. So basically the name of the company Artem is derived from the Latin phrase. I actually initially thought it was called Artyom, as in the Metro games, but it was actually Artem, so my mistake there. And also what they offer on their website is sailcloth straps, NATO straps, some additional spring bars, uh, different types of buckles and uh, also a wrist watch tool. Overall, they don't really have a huge offering on their website. They're very particular with what they want to make and how they want to make it. They basically want to make the perfect product, which is very good. Most uh, watch strap bands or brands like Barton, I don't know, Vario, etc. They have a huge offering, so they can't really focus on one thing to make it the best possible. They just have like maybe like medium level items here and there. However, Artem, on the other hand, is definitely focused on their goals, which I think is a pretty good thing indeed. Now, before we switch to the actual unboxing, check out how the straps arrive at your address. Quick wristwatch, check what am I wearing today. Today I'm wearing my Movement Arc Automatic Watch. I already made a review of this watch. If you're interested, the link is in the description of this video, and it's on their PAM sail cloth strap. So again, if you're interested in the movement review, link is in the description. And now let's check how the straps actually arrive at your house. And let's take a quick look at how Arden watch straps come to your address, or at least how they came to my address anyway. Both the sailcloth and NATO straps came in the same exact packaging. You get this plastic Ziploc bag, which you open like so. Then inside you have another bag. It is a cardboard one, which I always have issues opening. But here we go. I'm not opening, taking it out of this one. So yes, you get the second cardboard back box, whatever. It's all white. At the front, you have the Artem logo in blue. And then you open this like so, like so. And you are greeted with the strap you ordered. Like for example, this one, this is the Commander NATO strap. And inside of this cardboard box is also blue. And here we have the Artem motto. Ars est celare artem, the letters are in silver. So again, it's the same kind of packaging for the sailcloth strap as well. Plastic Ziploc bag, you get the cardboard box inside, you get artem at the front, you open it like so, get the strap you ordered and that's pretty much it. So that's the packaging and now let's go to the initial perspective and continue talking about Artem and their products.
And we are back. So that was the Arden product unboxing experience. Overall, I think the packaging is pretty adequate. However, I think that it used to be even better before. I think you got a bigger like all blue cardboard box or something like that. I'm not sure. Maybe I got the inferior packaging because I got sent in the products for free or maybe they just changed their packaging. I'm not sure. If I'm right, leave a comment down below. I think uh, that they used to have better packaging before, but the box is not as important as the straps themselves. So let's start with the main deal, the sailcloth straps, because they are their main products. So I got sent two sailcloth straps from Artem, their classic model and their PAM model. And let's start with the classic model first, of course. Now, the classic sailcloth strap is an all black sailcloth strap, and it's made out of two parts. The upper part is made of a synthetic sailcloth material and the lower part is made out of leather with a rubber coating. Now, the design of this strap is based on the sailcloth strap which comes with the Blancpain 50 Fathoms watch. Now, one thing I should emphasize is that this is in fact a water resistant strap so you can go swimming, you can go diving with this strap and you don't have to worry about it falling apart in the water which is not that common actually with aftermarket sailcloth strap believe it or not. And let's talk about the clasp as well because the clasp is pretty good. The clasp on this strap is a butterfly clasp and it has great finishing. It is a fully polished strap with the Artem logo on it. And when you open the clasp on the inside, the finishing is brushed. And the design of this butterfly clasp is based on the design found on Richard Millet watches. So it is a spring mechanism which is used to keep the clasp closed or to open it. There are no buttons on the side uh, to click to close or open the butterfly clasp. You just pull it open and snap it to close. It is a very good grip uh, if you ask me. Like if you would have the strap with you, you would understand what I'm saying. It's a very, very good quality clasp. And that's it regarding the classic strap. Now let's talk a bit more about the PAM sailcloth strap, the one I'm wearing on my movement watch. So this one is also a black strap like the classic one. The difference being in the stitching where the PAM strap has gray stitching, unlike the black one on the classic model. It is also water resistant. So again, you can go swimming, you can go diving and it will not fall apart in the water. On this one, we have a classic buckle design which also has excellent finishing. I would even argue better finishing than some of the watches I had to take a look at on this channel. Uh, so it is brushed with a high polished chamfered edge and we also have the Artem logo on this buckle as well. And the design of the PAM strap is like the one found on certain Panerai watches. Now some more things that are common with both of these straps is that both of these straps have a quick release mechanism. Uh, you don't need a watch tool to remove these or attach the strap which is pretty cool. It actually makes my job a lot easier to change the straps and put them on different watches. But I also want to say that you are free to choose if you want to put quick release spring bars or regular spring bars in case for some reason you don't like the quick release mechanism. And the sailcloth straps are also very comfortable to wear. So they both fit my wrist right away when I first unboxed the straps, which is again not that common with sailcloth strap straps, usually they're pretty firm, pretty rough. It takes a couple of weeks for them to adjust to your wrist. Uh, these two fit perfectly almost, like almost perfectly from day one. On day two, they fit actually perfectly. Uh, so for example, I have an experience with the Barton sailcloth strap. That one took weeks to conform to my wrist. This one was perfect from day one. One, and the price of these uh, straps is like this. The classic strap with the butterfly clasp is $158 and the PAM with the classic buckle is $146. So that's it regarding the sailcloth straps. And now let's talk about the NATO straps I got. So the NATO straps were truly a surprise. I honestly expected they would just send me one sailcloth strap and that's it. But I got two of the sailcloth straps and three of the NATO straps as a bonus. Uh, the build quality of the NATO straps is excellent. Uh, they are made out of a nylon polyamide material to be exact. And the metal parts are made of course out of 316L stainless steel. Now they're not too stiff, they're not too stretchy. They are a perfect fit again out of the box as with the sailcloth straps. For example, if you had a Seagull 1936, you know how their olive NATO strap is not really the best quality. Uh, Artem is truly wonderful quality out of the box, perfect. And I got three straps as I already said. I got the Commander one, which is a mix of gray, blue and red colors. The Bond NATO strap, which is a mix of gray and black and an all black NATO strap. 
and the price for these NATO straps is $63 each. So every NATO strap you saw in this video costs $63. And finally, uh, to come to a final conclusion about these products, if I recommend you to wear them, I wore them for over a month at this point, and I honestly have no complaints. For me personally, they are the best quality NATO and sailcloth straps I've ever worn. I have an experience with uh, a couple of different uh, NATO strap uh, brands, and I have some experience wearing sailcloth straps as well because I just like the design of them. In fact, I still have the Barton one on my Seiko 5. Um, these are the best quality I have ever experienced. All are very comfortable. Uh, I never got a strap that fits perfectly from day one. That was really something I did not expect when I unboxed these initially. Uh, now, having this in mind, this is, let's face it, a pretty expensive strap. You have almost $160 for a sailcloth strap. However, this is a bit more on the luxury side. This is not for somebody who has a Seiko 5 and wants to put it on a Arden strap. This is for somebody who has a Blanc Pond 50 Fathoms and wants to buy a new sailcloth strap. And why would they waste their money on buying the OEM strap from Blanc Pond when they can get the Arden one for literally half the price? Or maybe you want to put on a Rolex Mariner, your Omega Seamaster or whatever. I think these are very, very good. I think you'll be very pleased with these straps and you will be uh, buying one or maybe three next time you want to purchase some more sailcloth or needle straps. I'm very thankful to Artem for sending these products to me. They did not necessarily even change my overall perception because I like to keep my reviews as objective as possible. I don't really care if it's a sponsor review or not. It doesn't really matter to me. I don't really make any money out of this. So again, I, I just say it as it is. In all honesty, I think Artem is a very good product. I think it is well worth your money. And if you want to buy some Artem products, link is in the description of this video. And that's more or less it with regards to this review. Now, if you like this video, of course, leave a thumbs up. If you dislike the video, leave a thumbs down and maybe give me some suggestions on how I can improve my content. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more wristwatch or fragrance related videos. And until next time, guys, have a great day and 